they had a lot of good color in it variation so I'm taking that back off what I just put on still wet I'm gonna take it off so I used the burnt sienna simulating some wood And I'm going to come back in with the burnt sienna. That mailbox will cast a shadow up there so I really need some of that dark color that I mixed up here I'm rather pleased that I used most of the paint this time and notice how I did that it's at an angle so it looks like there's more shadow on one side than the other the only problem with that is the light is coming from that way and it should be angled that direction And we just fix it by adding more shadow on that side. And taking a little off that side. I like the way that pole looks kind of beat up. And I'm going to go with it. It's beat up in here and wider down there. I kind of like it. And what I need to do is address this piece that's hanging over here. Didn't get much attention. The light is going to come from that direction. So this is not going to be it's going to really be sort of in shadow I'm trying to go with the shape and direction of it which is not doing a whole lot but in here, adding a really thin layer of white over this color that's in there is graying it down a bit. I can still see all the other colors that I laid on there but it's causing this rim to pop out or come forward much better and what I'm going to do is come back on that very rim with some dark right here that pushes this little light piece right here out towards me more. And let the light catch the inside of that. Not too bright, but just enough. And I think
I want this to look more rusty than anything else. So I'm just adding burnt sienna to it. Streaking it, as a matter of fact, with it. Not doing a whole lot. I should be able to put some yellow on that now. Just touches of the yellow. And that is hanging. The only problem is there's nothing really dark on that. make it pop the edge coming towards me or closer to me it should be better or more in focus than the back edge And I'm just really just dabbing a little paint here so it'll look like it's really just hanging on by a small piece of metal or something. I think that's a wrap. Other than coming here, I would normally come there with some paint, um, ink. I'm going to I'm going to turn this get that edge and some of that back edge. I think I'm going to put a little of this down here in the grasses. And that creates a little extra layer. I know it's blue. But blue is in green. I'm using the corner of this brush to give me spikes of grass. Just here and there. I think a light spot there would work. Even though the sun is not coming from that direction, It's not so one tone. And I think I really want, I know I keep going back, I really want something lighter. Right there in the foreground. With the edge of the brush, just the corner. corner of this because this is a flat brush I'm 
Okay. And I think that's it. Thank you for joining me. Until next time.